Okay, everybody, we've got a Fuzz Buster, a uh, vintage 1985 CB unit, as well as a Messenger uh, 250 base model, uh, 50th anniversary edition. We're going to see if we can get these guys to uh, function right and talk to each other. I've got them both randomly set uh, to channel 15. And this is Messenger 250 to Fuzzbuster. Messenger 250 to Fuzzbuster. Uh, check, check, check. Sounds about right. And let's see. This is Fuzzbuster to Messenger 250. Fuzzbuster to Messenger 250. Also sounds about right. Yeah, I also want to test out. I have an external speaker. Uh, hooked up right now to the Fuzz Buster. We want to test that out as well. I'm just going to bring that volume down a little bit. And there is the Cobra uh, external speaker. Cobra external speaker as well seems to be working properly. I'm going to go ahead and switch it over. Again, I'm sorry, I only have one of these externals. Uh, I'm going to move it over to the Messenger there and to activate that uh actually we need to pull this knob out just a hair uh right there pa pull and we're gonna go ahead and see if the cover speaker does appear to be working properly uh through the messenger 250. so um that's what we have got here unfortunately the um lights on the display of the messenger are not currently working. I did open up the unit and they do appear to be soldered in place. I've never seen that before and I'm not really comfortable uh, messing with them. So if uh, you know you like fiddling with these things, maybe you wanna upgrade to an LED, just be aware that they are soldered in place and will need to be uh, replaced.